What is identity theft? Identity theft is the misuse of another person's identity either by acquiring or using their name, social security number, driver's license, credit card, or other banking info without the consent of the owner. The main goal of a criminal using identity theft is to acquire funds and or goods, transfer money, or to acquire personal information. The leading form of identity theft is credit card fraud. Did you know identity theft rose 33% from 2005 to 2010? U.S. households incurred $13.3 billion in direct financial loss due to identity theft. 54% of identity theft cases are the result of misused and abused credit cards. How is an identity stolen? Stolen purses or wallets, dumpster diving, and shoulder surfing are the most common and low-tech ways false identities are acquired. Canceling credit and debit cards when a wallet or purse is lost or stolen is crucial to protecting damaging identity theft. Dumpster diving is when a criminal digs through garbage to find personal information from items like old bills or pre-approved credit card offers. Shoulder surfing is when a person is glancing over your shoulder to get your passwords to your financial accounts or to use them to access a secure network. More complicated techniques include when employees have been caught copying or compromising a customer's debit or credit card information during a transaction and then making their own purchases. Family members and friends can commit identity theft when they use a debit or credit card without permission. There are also criminals who design web pages or emails to look exactly like a big name company and they try and get your personal information via phishing. Well, what do you do if your identity is compromised? The first thing is you need to take these steps. Place an initial fraud alert on your accounts. Order your credit reports and then create an identity theft report. Placing a fraud alert on your account so the bank has to verify your identity is the, best, the biggest first step you can take. Fraud alerts are free to place and to remove, so there's no hassle for you. Um, be sure to create a phone log with the date of each call and the names and numbers of everyone you contact. Have questions ready ahead of time. If you're corresponding by mail, send letters by certified mail and ask for a receipt. Create a filing system to keep records organized. If you need to send any documents to companies, keep the originals and send only the copies. Make sure you have a calendar ready to keep track of deadlines of when to file requests and when to follow up. Next, how do you fix your credit after identity theft has happened? First, check your credit report for fraudulent charges or fraudulent accounts that you didn't open. Be sure all of your personal information is correct. If you find errors, be sure to report them to your credit reporters as well as the fraud departments of the businesses that reported an error. Prevention is the best medicine. At home, lock up all valuable information, limit what information you take when you go out, so leave your birth certificates at home, your social security cards. Um, also, be cautious about who you share your information with. Make sure when you're finished with any um, credit card applications or any other mail that contains personal information that you shred all of the unwanted documents. When you are online, be aware that there are people who are fishing for information. Don't give out personal information via mail, phone, or over the internet. Always encrypt your data to guard online transactions. Create strong passwords that use capital letters and numbers and keep these passwords private. Be aware of the information that you are sharing on a social networking sites. In conclusion, identity theft causes billions of dollars of financial loss each year. The biggest way to protect yourself is to be vigilant about protecting your information and being aware of your financial transactions. If you suspect you have been a victim of identity theft, please visit this website for more information about how to recover your identity. Thank you. Created using Powtoon.